Hi there everyone, we're back uh, with another video here and this time we're looking at Life 3D Life 3D Avatar, those uh, you see here are not always Life 3D but we'll be talking about Life 3D, how to have your own Life 3D Avatar um, It's like those friends, right? <laughs> so how do you get one? You have uh, Vero Mobile, that's a, a new application uh, that you can use to create your own avatar very 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 on 3d avatar very easily so yeah we'll see you on the next side just download that it's free so there we are uh in the application now and it's pretty much your choice uh you want to do a male or a female and that's it and boom you're, you're pretty much done <laughs> already uh, if you don't modify anything, you're pretty much done. You can go to check mark at the top here, name your character, and you're done. <laughs> pretty much. Well, we can go a little bit deeper, right? Uh, we can change the cloud and stuff. Uh, right? We can go a little deeper. We can change the, the color. The body proportion, chest size, chest size ladder, very important, right? There you go. In the in the virtual world with your home 3D avatar, I can move in space, uh, just like that. <laughs> easy, right? Easy. How hard that was. That was pretty easy. That's why I say the easiest application right now to make your home avatar. Even easier than Life 2D. Uh, we uh, already talk about. 3D avatar is pretty easy with this application. Easiest thing in the world. It costs you nothing as well. Uh, you want more customization? Sure. If you want more customization, you will need more, but that's very, that's a good way to start, at least. Then when you're done uh, checking your avatar, you want to upload it in the cloud, store it in the internet, so you can uh, access it and download it, because right now you use only in the application. You have to uh, download it. So to be able to download it, you will have to click on the upload sign just on top of the camera. And we'll publish a character on VWord Hub. Publish, but it's going to be published privately, so. But you can always make it public, public but it will be a private avatar when you first publish it on VWord Hub. And if you get the same error that I did, uh, character in the sound. That's uh, because you, you're not logging your account, so you have to do a Pixiv account to log into Viewer Hub, just like that, Pixiv account. And when you have your, uh, and when you log, that's where you end up in Viewer Hub with your avatar showing up. You can view your avatar outside of the application. And now uh, you want your avatar, so you'll go scroll down. And download your home model and download your home model and they tell you the terms of application terms of use uh basically you can use it anywhere but you can modify it only modify it in vroom mobile pretty much agree download boom and after that uh where can you use it you can uh, do like us and use it for streaming there's some application you can use there's so many and there will be even more in the future that you can use for uh for streaming uh, another thing that you see here is uh, vr uh, so if you have a vr set uh, like the vibe shown here i mean yeah you can move your uh, character around as well that's the same character you made on vr mobile <laughs> that you can use for that too pretty cool pretty cool i don't have it yet but yeah that's another thing you can do uh, also, you can do augmented reality uh, VR, with VR Mobile. Uh, that's VR Mobile there. And you go into a real physical location and you can put your avatar on top. On top of that location. So, here is an example of what you can do with end tracking. Uh, this is the application. The streaming tools here is VHub. That's one of the applications you can use. And. With end tracking, that's what you can do. You can move your hand around. Uh, unlike us here, we didn't buy that, but yeah. And the most famous one is uh, Leap Motion. And yeah. 
So yeah, that's pretty much it, right? We saw how to make your Hona 3D avatar. We saw how to upload it. And then after that, you use the file, the .vrm, and in another software. That's about software. And you saw the opportunity we can do with augmented reality and VR as well. So, and we're done here, right? We covered everything. So, until next time, bye friend, bye.